now we come to the older games. So this one is for eight and up. So it's for adults and families. Yes. And it's a dice game. I think it's been a while since there was a family dice game in your portfolio. Yeah, that's why we made that. <laughs> <laughs> it's uh, Rolling Bandits. Yeah. It's uh, from Pretty Gilbert. All right, he's already did a dice game this year. So another one. Yeah, another one. All right. Uh, in Rolling Bandits, so each player gets seven dice, which are who are the seven bandits of its of its color, and we will try to rob the train. So if you have a very very long table, you can uh, place them train. in a in yeah. rain. But now you have to imagine this is a, <laughs> a yes. train like this. So when you turn to play, the, your goal obviously is to rob the wagons, so to win the cards wagons, which was the points indicated here. And it's also the minimum uh, number of bandits you need to have to collect it. All right. On each wagon you have also a safe and to win this safe you, you have need a combination. the combination um, so, so we will need play. always three of the same yeah right we'll play until all the cards are gone all at the same time no or? it's turn by turn because right. there will be majority and progression so when it's my turn to play i roll the dice this is joker so i can choose one type of my choice let's imagine i do that And I place them on the train, starting by the end of the train. So let's say I do this because I can get the safe. You have three kinds of safe, two special effects that you can play wherever you want. But you also have the bomb. The bomb I will explain. You, well, I can explain by now. When you reveal the bomb, all the dice are discarded except one of each color because it's a bomb yes. <laughs> this one you can switch to group of dice right. and the other one you can re-roll dice so when you get the good combination you get the safe you have victory points on it and depending if you use it or not it's point for the end of the game then you have to you can continue like this i uh, will do that and that this is the end of my turn. You will play, imagine you will do something like this, 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 up. Let's imagine you do that. It's my turn again. At the beginning of my turn, I will see if I have majorities. For this one, I'm in majority. I have at least three dice, so I win the card. It's victory point for the end of the game. This, it's minimum two, I have it also. The safe have not been taken, it's discarded. This one, I don't have it. But Blue will win it. Blue will have it at the beginning of his turn, if I don't have more dice on it. So, it's my turn to play. I can choose to remove some dice, but I have to start from the end and I can't remove the last dice because you, will, you have to progress and I re-roll the dice I start again I can do this so you, you progress in the things like this what is interesting strategically it's that imagine at the beginning of my next turn I have something like this it's not interested it's not interesting but I let them here, I re-roll. Then you start, start from there. From here. So uh, it's like a race, it's also a race to try to get the most, is the more interesting and cards and safes. And can you choose which dice to put there or do you have to put every dice every of dice one illustration? You have, ah, yeah. right. you have to place them. Okay. So the best is to have all different then you only pay one. Yeah, but you to can go yeah. far away on the train. All right. And the game ends when we are on the last card. Yeah. And then you count the points. Exactly. And whoever got the most wins. Yeah, it's really original. <laughs> <laughs> Rolling Bandits. Yeah. And it's available to, uh, since now. It's already available. Uh, we are sold out here, but uh, it's it, it have been released in France uh, last, uh, last week. 
All right. Yeah. Great. Thanks for the explanation. Welcome.